Alright, so today is day three of uh, chemo. I never got a video up yesterday because I was well beyond tired. Um, that seems to be my biggest side effect so far is uh, how tired I've been. Uh, I can hardly uh, function even now tonight. Uh, and I've been asleep off and on part of the afternoon. Um, other than that, my real um, symptoms, I guess, so far would be some tingling in my hands and feet, and, uh, I just took a shower, and I noticed a few extra hairs on the hands, so maybe it might be time to shave my head fairly soon. I'm not going to be one of those spotchy guys. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I guess, uh, because I missed yesterday, I'll try to, uh, give you guys somewhat of a story about how I uh, originally found out that I had testicular cancer. I, um, when I lived, back when I lived in Res, uh, in the showers, there was, uh, posters posted about testicular self-exams, and, uh, ever since then, I have, uh, done them myself. Uh, I think it's pretty, uh, important. Uh, I'm glad I did. Um, so, uh, anyways, I didn't, I don't do them overly regularly, but I do do them, and, uh, one night when I was in the shower, I just checked myself, and I noticed a lump, uh, it was fairly sizable at the time, so, uh, I guess it had been growing there for a while, um, I didn't have a family doctor, as I mentioned before, I, uh, really haven't been sick much, so I haven't had much point of having a doctor. So I uh, just went to the clinic, and uh, the doctor there um, checked it and shone a light through it, and he thought it was definitely something that needed to be checked on, so he uh, mentioned to me that it may be cancer. Um, I left the clinic that day and uh, freaked out a little bit um, for like... 15 minutes to a half hour, I was just basically a wreck. Um, but then I realized that no matter what it was, um, I needed to get through it. And uh, supposing that meant surgery or chemo or what it ever had to be, it had to be. And uh, I wasn't going to go down without a fight. So uh, I just moved on and didn't tell anybody for a couple weeks until I actually met with the specialist. Uh, my urologist, who confirmed that it was most likely cancer uh, about two weeks later. Um, and he wanted to do surgery, so he uh, set all that up. And two weeks later, on July 4th, um, I had my left testicle removed. Um, I was a little afraid I was going to walk on a slant, but <laughs> hasn't been a problem since. Um, so, I, uh, yeah, so that was how I found out I had testicular cancer. Uh, since then, I had some additional CAT scans and stuff, which confirmed that it had moved into my lymph nodes, and, uh, the biopsy of the cancer actually came back as a uh, fast-moving type of cancer, and not one that can just be watched or whatnot. So, um... Yeah, uh, they decided that they want to do this chemo. So yeah, I'm on a fairly heavy dosage, I guess. Uh, three bags, uh, well, five times week one, uh, one time on week two, one time on week three. On week one, I get two bags every day, but on Tuesday I get three bags of chemo. And then the additional uh, medicine I get on the Tuesday, I also get on the other two Tuesdays of the following weeks. Uh, it's, uh, not fun. <laughs> um, I still have uh, my arm in a little bit of a cast and my bed's unmade because I am exhausted and I've been sleeping. <laughs> um, but yeah, the cast is just to protect my little uh, IV that I have in my arm there so that I don't have to get poked with holes every single day. Um, this Friday, uh, it's going to be my, it's going to be November, uh, Remembrance Day, November 11th, 
um, and I think they're going to take my IV out on Thursday, but they may put it back in on Friday, because I'll be admitted to the hospital for the day just to, uh, just to get my uh, chemo that day. Um, one thing that I found out is apparently one of the chemicals that I take um, will actually prevent me from ever scuba diving because it potentially damages your lungs and uh, you can't handle high oxygen contents anymore. So scuba diving, which is something I've always sort of wanted to do, uh, is out. So I guess me and sharks won't be getting comfortable, which seems odd. Anyways, <laughs> uh, so yeah, um, sorry that I'm so drawn out and my thoughts aren't together. I uh, am kind of tired. <laughs> uh, probably going to try to upload this and go straight to bed. Um, but yeah, that's how I found out I had cancer and uh, hoping I have enough energy to make another one of these tomorrow. And I hope I'm not cutting off my entire head. <laughs> All right. See you guys.